Wait, anybody, and anybody knew, the couple people knew. So if you missed the poll, the answer is I don't know what to tell you. You missed the poll. Dancers. There's nothing, nothing else to be said about that. Um, but uh, thanks for coming. Um, and um, I decided this year rather than have a birthday party where people brought me presents, I'd have a birthday party where I would ask people to make donations to St. Louis for AIDS. So that I invited some friends who are performers to come and perform and got the space. And it's been a great night so far. And um, Rob is one of my favorite, favorite entertainers in the St. Louis area. And um, I'm sure he's going to put on a great show for you. Without further ado, let's see. Thank you. Thank, thank you, Steve. Um, uh, all right. You guys can hang out over here because I'm just going to walk over here with you, you know? Right, let's test the limits of this thing. Can I go all the way over here? Is that too much trouble? What about over here? There's a pee. I don't hear nobody told me. We're going to incorporate that into the next time. Okay. My friends! My friends, I'd like to tell you a story from many, 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 many eons ago. Way back 27.4 million minutes. When there was born unto the world a man so powerful and so absolute and so enormous in his presence, his name was Steve Holdsworth. <laughs> Atari 2600. <laughs> so he worked and slaved all summer long at the laundromat, putting clothes in the washer, taking clothes out of the washer, pouring the soap in into the dryer, everything, bagging them up, folding. And he eventually, at the end of that summer, saved enough to buy this Atari 2600. So he said it was he, he took it straight home, straight home, people, and he plugged it Lo and behold, it would not work. Now Steve had not slaved all summer long for a bunk Atari 2600. Oh, no, I had. Oh, no, I had. So ever since he's worn this shirt, it says, fuck the system. <laughs> Atari 2600, the system. <laughs> That was a little introductory introduction. Um, <laughs> next, I'd uh, like to play. Uh, do we? Do, are there any Star Trek fans here? <clears throat> no, none. Okay, well that's, that's all right. Uh, I'm gonna play uh, a brand new song I've never played before in front of a live studio audience, and it's uh, called "I Have Gone." It's a doo-wop song about um, Star Trek. <laughs> Can everybody hear this ukulele okay? Should I turn down this a little bit? Or? Yeah. You can't hear it as much. About like that. <laughs> <laughs> 